We are going through the regular legal channels uh, that are involved when we try to extradite somebody. Uh, I have not called President Xi personally or President Putin personally, and the reason is because, uh, number one, I shouldn't have to. This is something that routinely is dealt with uh, between law enforcement officials in various countries. Number two, we've got a whole lot of business that we do with China and Russia, and I'm not going to have one case of uh, a suspect who we're trying to extradite uh, suddenly being elevated to the point where I've got to start doing wheeling and dealing and trading on a whole host of other issues uh, simply to get a guy uh, extradited so that he can face uh, – the justice system here in the United States. My continued expectation is that uh, Russia or other countries that have talked about potentially providing Mr. Snowden asylum recognize that they are part of an international community and that they should be abiding by international law. Um, and we'll continue to press them as hard as, uh, as, hard as we can uh, to make sure that they do so. Uh, but, but, but let me – one last thing, because you asked a, a final question. Uh, no, I'm not going to be scrambling jets uh, to get a 29-year-old uh, hacker.